Okay, I wanted to do a quick lesson on questions. Questions in English are difficult because we must use an auxiliary verb. So if you have a simple question like Ti grais for football, um, you, you can't just say you play football, it's not possible. You play football is, is necessary to use those words, but you are missing a word. You are missing an auxiliary verb. In English, we must have an auxiliary verb. And, in present simple, with you, the auxiliary verb is do. Do you play football? Or does he play football? Okay, that's okay for present simple. Um, by the way, if you want to say когда ты играешь в футбол, when do you play football? We just need to add the question word, when. Okay, um, but you always use the auxiliary verb in every tense. So, if we ask a question in past simple, um, what did did is the auxiliary in past simple. What did they do last night? What did they do last night? Okay. I don't know. What did you do last night? Think and answer in past simple. Okay. If we have present continuous, um, what are or is or am is what we use with present continuous. What are you doing at the moment? Okay, doing at the moment. What are you doing at the moment? I am teaching. Are you listening? Are you studying? Are you making notes? I hope so. Um, so, remember are you but what is he doing? Okay, what is he doing? What am I doing? Okay, that's present continuous for at the moment. Now let's think about past continuous. What were you doing? Were with you, but was with he or she? What was he doing? What was she doing? What were you doing at 10 p.m. last night? Okay, at 10 p.m. last night, I was watching Sherlock Holmes. What were you doing at 10 p.m. last night? Answer the question. Okay, but what was he doing? Remember that there's a was with he or she or it. Um, okay, what about present perfect? How long have is the auxiliary verb for present perfect, you, known, him. How long have you known him? How long have you lived here? How long um, have you worked in your company? Okay? It's when you ask about a period of time present perfect, and please remember, have the auxiliary verb before you, not how long you have known him, how long have you known him? How long have you known him? Okay, um, what about future? Um, let's say, uh, who will, who will you go with? Okay, again, we've got first form. After will, do, does, did, and will all have infinitive first form at the end. So, who will you go with? Okay, if you want to use going to, who are you going to go with? It's all logical. It follows the same order. Who are you going to go with? Okay, and if we want to use a modal verb, no problem. Can you speak English? Okay, can is a modal verb. Yeah, we just say, can you sp speak English? Or can he speak English? Can he speak? After can, we use infinitive as well, speak. Okay, 
Um, that's all I wanted to talk about today. I hope you liked the lesson and I hope you subscribe. Please put questions under the video and I'm happy to answer them. Thanks for watching. Please subscribe if you've enjoyed this lesson and would like to receive more over the next few weeks. Uh, here are some videos on phrasal verbs, auxiliary verbs, tenses and verb forms as well like gerunds and 2 plus infinitive. Um, please watch them and try the quizzes below the videos and uh, I hope that you improve.